Yo, what is going on, guys? We're back with another video. On this one, we're going to be playing a little bit of Modern Warfare 2. Now, if you guys didn't know, it seems like Season 2 has been delayed. Over on Twitter, Charlie Intel has been tweeting out that Season 2 has been delayed about, like, 15 days. It was supposed to come out, like, February 1st. Now, it's expected to come out February 15th. And that honestly just kind of put a damper on my mood. It feels like this battle pass and this season have been dragging on. And right now, Warzone is in desperate need of an update. They gotta fix something because that game is like 50-50 for me. You're either frying, having a really good time, or it's just the most mind-numbing game you can possibly play. So I want Season 2 to come as quickly as possible. I'm kind of disappointed it got delayed. Hopefully this delay either means they're going to take their time on it and there will be less bugs when they implement the update or they're just making up for lost time because of the Christmas holiday break, all that. What I'm most excited for for Season 2 is hopefully that they'll implement the CDL playlist instead of just the CDL mosh pit that we can actually have a ranked mode for multiplayer. And hopefully in Season 2 we'll also get a Warzone update. I'm not expecting anything big. I'm not expecting any like movement changes or anything like that but hopefully they could just like maybe let us sprint while plating and give us the resurgence map that is rumored to come i don't know how resurgence is gonna play with the current warzone 2 play style it could be really ratty it could be just like a bigger almazra we don't really know there's not much movement in this game so there's like no finesse or anything but i want to know what you guys think down in the comments below do you guys think rebirth is gonna be a w or is it gonna be an l i honestly believe rebirth island is gonna be warzone's last savior if they can't do anything with rebirth island or resurgence then i think warzone is dead in the water because apparently statistics have showed that warzone has lost over 70 percent of its player base which is absolutely insanity another sad thing that we did see on twitter today Another sad thing we did see on Twitter today is that Skump has finally retired from being in the CDL. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I used to watch like Skump, Nadeshot, Big Timer, Merc, all those guys when they were all on Optic playing Black Ops 2 when I was a kid. I used to look up to those guys, still do. I used to watch all their matches, their streams every single day, and then at night I'd go and play Black Ops 2 League play every single day. And it's kind of sad seeing them all gone now. Scum did say he's going to start making more content, so hopefully we'll get a lot more content out of him. I love watching his videos. He wasn't really able to do it because of the competition is so high, so he's always got to be locked in playing scrims and all that. But it still is sad seeing him go. Another thing I do hope we see in Warzone 2 is a ranked play mode, kind of like how Apex has it. Obviously, they're going to have to increase the TTK and make a few changes, but I think I'd be way more addicted to Warzone 2 if there was a ranked play mode. Because right now, there's nothing really to grind for in this game anymore. I already have Orion, so there's not much for me to do. Everybody says I should grind for the weapon charms and the, the calling cards and all that, but that doesn't really sound appealing to me. I don't really care about any of that stuff. That's going to do it for this video today, guys. Make sure to comment down below what you guys think all the new updates coming in Season 2. Do you think it's going to be a W or an L? Subscribe to the channel if you are new and drop a like and I'll see you guys in the next one.